the energy vibration reading for the second week and it's for the Gemini Sun Moon Horizon sign this is the second week of January 2019 I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back thank you for the wonderful support likes and shares and this week is a week of the devil the week of the emotion a lot of people with a lot of emotions but yet still the situation that is happening and playing out we are going to be seeing positive situation as I was shuffling um, your reading we have um, it came out like this so the regrets are over whoever that was going um, that was having some regrets out there um, let it go let it go okay um, it came out like this like this yeah it's 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 over okay so some of you Gemini was having some regrets about the situations and this regret is now over okay I want to thank you so much I love you Gemini please like share these videos subscribe 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 and share 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 listen to your Sun Moon Horizon sign and cross watch to see who um these people your partners and these people around you how they're affecting you okay so let's look and see what's happening to you Gemini's in this second week oh my god oh my god <laughs> the seven of cups in the reverse okay Gemini Sun Moon Horizon for the second week of January Gemini Sun Moon and Rising sign second week of January what's happening um, the Queen of Pentacles in the reverse okay the world is here for you Gemini's Queen of Pentacles is in the reverse and the world is here um the power which is the four of coins is coming up on Thursday let's see what's coming up on Friday a new start you're moving on whatever is going on there's a new start and you're moving on what's coming out in the weekend happiness and happiness oh 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 Happiness in the weekend, nine of cups, your wishes and dreams are coming true. Happiness in the weekend, nine of cups, your wishes and dreams are coming true. Wonderful. So what we have here, we have you dealing with the king of um, the king of um, the you're dealing, your outcomes is that. A lot of you will be dealing with this man this man is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn whoever this man is um, you're bringing an end to a situation with this man whoever this man is he's a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn and you're definitely bringing it a hand to this person whoever this person is um, whatever has transpired justice did not go in his favor okay so if you're dealing with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn man justice didn't go in his favor okay or justice didn't go in your favor so it can vice versa so it depends because there's a lot of you guys and a lot of situations so these are the two um, especially for the people who are in legal situations and this could be a husband or um, a divorce segment or a legal suit with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn um, but justice in reverse with this person that means that justice didn't go in its favor did it go in your favor for some of you yes not for all of you okay so okay whoever the star is Virgory or a Capricorn person is this man justice never goes in his favor okay so um, we have shuffled the cards already um, so we're going to be looking okay there's some justice whoever this uh, man is could be a boss uh, could be a father could be a husband could be um, the neighbors that you are having some legal situation where justice didn't go for him okay so let's see what's happening let's see what's happening for the Gemini in this week What's happening for the Gemini's? The Gemini's in this week, 
Gemini's in this week. The Gemini's in this week. Okay. Alrighty. Now, a lot of stuff. Gemini's in this week. You have the Seven of Cups. So, whatever the situation that some of you Gemini had with a Pisces, Cancer, or a Squirt, no, a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn between the ages of 18 and 45, whatever that was, it's no longer, whatever the offer was on the table, it's no longer there. Um, because, um, I, you know, this lady kind of realized that this lady is a smart lady, whoever she is, she's smart. She knows that something isn't right. And she is like, okay, all right, I'm stepping back. So whoever this lady is, she's just stepping back. She's just dealing with some certain situation and she's stepping back. She's realizing that um, you can receive a lot of offer, but whoever is given this offer and however this offer is coming in, it's not something that I should be um, um, connected with. So this lady is um, stepping back. She's, she's turning her back. She's stepping back from her offer. So some of you young people could be in relationship with a Capricorn, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn, and she decide to, no, I don't think this is, this is what I want to be in. And she's stepping back. A lot of you are dealing with the Taurus Virgo or Capricorns and they're all, um, like they're standing up. Okay. Um, whatever is happening, if this is your mom or this is someone that you were dealing with a lady 45 years and older um, she's like I say my piece and I'm ending this okay so this lady just say her piece and said hey I say my piece and I'm ending this for whatever the situation is and whatever is transpiring I'm saying my piece and ending this for whatever that has transpired I'm saying my piece and ending this and I don't need to go over this and I'm not going to go over this okay whatever has transpired is as if these um, uh, hurt sign people are just uh, hey no bullshit this year I'm, I'm beginning the year off in a good um, note no bullshit so whoever the star is Virgo or Capricorn woman was it's as if she's like I'm out there I just say my piece I'm out there I'm not keeping down anything and any and anymore I'm just saying my piece and let it go and she's right she's right whatever the situation is she's right she's like I really don't want to play this game this year and I'm just going to say my piece and let it go and that's what she has done now what is happening here is that whoever was dealing with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person um, the situation has been ended now um, whether it was your children who were Taurus Virgo or Capricorns the situation has now ended okay um, it is um, a situation where whatever if this was your wife if this was your daughter if this was a child if it, this was a, a girlfriend or a relationship or a friendship they have said their piece and they are like I've said my piece it's over I don't want to deal with this anymore I'm moving forward and you're being protected because um, you're realizing you know maybe this is for the best and um, you're very protected because you're realizing you know whatever and whoever um, if it's not a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn but it is earth sign people who are saying their piece and they're walking away and they're like I don't need to do this anymore and that's how they're feeling now the power and the four of Pentacles is in reverse another another situation where um, some of you ladies um, are down um, to nothing okay it's like some of you ladies um, your financial situation is like way way nothing zinch zero um for some of you you're releasing and showing that there is nothing i'm not holding on to nothing there is nothing that i have been holding on to that sort of a situation you're playing and opening up your cards to show hey there was nothing so whatever people are saying there's absolutely nothing here i'm opening my hands 
I'm showing you I have to build from um, start and there is nothing so um, this is good because um, what is transpiring is that some of you ladies have to really realize that now um, your, your 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 life is basically changing so whatever this change is you're realizing that your life is basically changing and you have to make a new start so it's affecting men and women that a new start you have to make a new start some of you are zitch niche um, and you need to make a new start some of you decide to move forward and um, the happiness there is some sadness because you're deciding to move forward and here or the men 45 years and older also the men 45 years and older you're also um, moving forward you're deciding to end the relationships with um, a woman that is a um, Taurus Virgo or Capricorn or she as uh, as, as a center piece and she's ending the relationship with you guys so if you are um, over 45 years and older and you were married with a Capricorn a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn she's in a relationship and she say no more I'm not doing this anymore the love is no more there um, and she's ending the relationship she's she's really um, leaving you behind she's basically ending the relationship and leaving you behind whatever the situation is is that she's saying like now um, so you're deciding to move forward some of you um, the six of cups obviously is the end um, of a family a past life situation and she's decide you're deciding to move forward from a family situation this is definitely relationships that is coming to an end um, these are past life issues that you're working on and these are coming to an end okay and so some of you could find out that your partner is in a relationship with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius okay um, you're gonna be finding out that your partner is in a relationship with an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius and um, yeah it's it's not very positive and it's uh, you ladies it's gonna affect you ladies that you're finding out that your partner is in a, um, a relationship with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius okay now um, you're finally happy about the situation a negative situation is finally coming to an end and happiness is returning to your life so some of you are really really going to be at gone through a negative situation with um, an uh, Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn and now you're happy that the situation has finally finally and there was some lies there was deceptiveness there was people working negative energies and that sort of a situation and this you're going to be finding out in sometimes in the weekend you have water 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 so it's good for you guys in the weekend water 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 it's good for you guys in this weekend it is very very positive for you guys in the weekend so water 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 is coming up for you guys um, information is going to be coming out judgment calls and with this judgment calls a lot of you are going to be finding yourself on a positive journey ahead in a good positive way and this is going to be extremely extremely good okay so let's see what is happening with this king of Pentacles and justice king of Pentacles and justice king and Pentacles and justice um, some deception okay um, so there was some deception situation but now some of you are going to be having a new start so it could be deceptive situation with your children your children father the star is Virgo or Capricorn and now and um, this situation is going to be resolved okay um, I want some of you to be careful if you're deciding to go on a new journey in the weekend or go um, away on the weekend be careful to protect your kids use the fire energy in this week okay so you have the number number 14 fire element and it says I ignite fire within me that connects to me to the divine so you guys have the fire energy and this is positive this is good I want to say to each and every person namaste until next time thank you for being here check out to all or these Capricorn people Taurus Virgos and Capricorn in your life how they're affecting your life because they're going to be affecting you in this week 
for the rest of you it's going to be a, a brilliant week and I want to say to each and every person um, thank you and namaste